a crowbar? Yeah, this is my snake hook now. I got tired of them always breaking on me because I tried to lift two heavy boards with them. <laughs> you made it to that end so quickly. I'm like watching every step. Oh. <laughs> like seeing how many rusty nails are in the way. Yeah. What is this, a house? Uh, I think it used to be. What the frick? Oh, I thought that was a camera lens. It is. It's not, it's a cup. Oh, it's a camera <laughs> lens cup? <laughs> have, right, you, have you never seen these cups before? I don't think so. That's so funny to actually see this out. I think it's more weird to find a camera lens cup than a lens. How important is day-to-day -day weather? Pretty important. Once it gets like above like 80, you can't really find anything oh. during, during the day. Okay. Um, it's been pretty dry lately, so that's why I've been excited about the rain. <laughs> Hold on, I can't hear you. <laughs> yeah, there's a clear difference from your efficiency five years ago. <laughs> You're just speeding through. Is that acoustic foam? What is that? Oh yeah, I think it is. Oh, it must have been a... a YouTuber lived here. <laughs> yeah, we got the photo cup and acoustic cup. There's a vinyl. I hope it's not quite this cool when we get there. It should be a couple degrees warmer. What's that? Uh, water snakes. Is that Santa Claus? <laughs> Is he okay? Oh man. <laughs> Do you ever encounter weird people when you're herping or is it oh, mostly yeah. just cops? I had a guy uh, trying to hitchhike at 2 a.m. once. In, wait, in like, oh, someone just ran across. Yeah, in like a, on a cruising road basically. Did you? No, I did not get him <laughs> Okay. I was alone at 2 a.m. Wait, why was it, so why would he have been there? Uh, he told me his car broke down and he was trying to get to his girlfriend's house but there was also no car anywhere nearby. <laughs> it was really weird. Mmm, mold smell. Mmm, mold. I felt bad for him if it was true though. I'm like, dang, that sucks. Wouldn't want to be <laughs> <laughs> Dang, that sucks, bye. Aside from finding lots of I mean, stuff. just like really sharp eyes. I think more than the eyes is like, I guess just, more your brain, maybe, like just being able to process like really small details. Like, I know someone who spotted a rough green snake in a tree going 60 miles an hour, like a I tree see. overhanging the car. So basically, the idea is everyone's passing tons of reptiles, it's just whether you're able to notice <laughs> yeah. them. Yeah. The rat or racer? Rat, I think. <laughs> I haven't had to think about it in a while. That's a dark rat for here. Oh, right in the swamp. Oh. Hey, buddy. That was pretty fast. Yeah. So he it's a dark rat? It, yeah, it looks very differently colored than. Well, he's very seen. dark for around here. Usually the greenish ones are a lot lighter than this. Oh, okay. But that's a nice one. It has more color to it. That's interesting. Did a musk? Yeah. <laughs> I have not smelled that in a long time. I still smell that very often. I don't know what I'm filming. There's no like, st I mean, I guess the storyline is just herping again. So. Go herping, go herping. Oh god, yeah. Now they're, they're gonna expect me. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's like, is it under, like if I got this in, I'd be like, oh, it's a little emaciated, but like just barely. But I guess yeah, it's I mean, a little, that's pretty normal for outside, yeah. Anything bigger than that, you would say, oh, he's fat or he's healthy. Because I feel like every wild snake just has like parasites, basically, that are just like eating like half their food. He was going this way, so let's move him across. Straight, straight here. Yeah, sure. Oh yeah, get the first bite of the day for me. 
He actually drew blood from you. He did not draw blood from me at all. <laughs> you must just have tougher skin or something. Because I don't feel it at all. <laughs> he barely touched me and I'm like, that's it. There you go. I'm too soft. I've been inside for five years. Man, I don't like the small snake musk. It smells so bad. <laughs> oh, I should have brought like... That's just rat snake musk too. Wait What's... till we get a king snake. Oh, it's worse? It's way worse. Way stronger. King snake like makes me nostalgic. The smell? Yeah. <laughs> have you had any off-road mishaps in the van like getting stuck? Oh yeah. I haven't gotten stuck since uh, I got it lifted except for when I ran over my exhaust. Do you have a, uh, like a winch? No. Alongside cruising, what are the other categories of herping? Do you cruise, you hike, and you flip. And I think flipping is like everyone's favorite, but in order to flip, you need to like have sights. So it's everyone's favorite because it's so satisfying to flip a snake or like flip something there's just a snake underneath. But yeah. it's definitely also like really difficult, but it pays off. It's high risk, high reward kind of, kind of herping. And there's cruising, which is what we're doing now, which many people consider to be the lazy form of herping. But uh, <laughs> I don't know, I spent a lot of nights where I've just been glued to a road all night and like really put in the work and it pays off. I just love driving, so I love it so much. And then there's hiking, which is like you just hike and hope to see one. It's basically just cruising, but you're just on foot. <laughs> so our OG stuff, I guess, was kind of hiking and flipping, like at the Eno yeah. or whatever. Yeah, in the middle of the day when it was way too hot to see anything. But... <laughs> yeah. I just have like folders of footage of like, all right, an intro, we're going herping, and then an outro, yeah. like, we found the <laughs> That's so true. Let me see if I can guess what it is. Is it an oak toad? It's either a feller's or an American. What do I do with them? Just bring right, them over. across the road. <laughs> Bug went in my mouth. I still like toads. Wait, Just let like, me look straight down. Oh, how did you? S okay, yeah, there it is. <laughs> He's directly beneath the cars, I don't know. Is he like under a tire? Uh, he's right, he, pull forward slowly. Yeah, keep going. Okay, yeah, you're good. You could just leave me here and nobody would know <laughs> I was here. And I have no service. Is that yeah, one? Toad, right. and that's toad for sure. So much of herping is like, people just say like random things as fact, even though they're just like totally guesses and we don't really know what's going on. <laughs> it's a great. Oh, I've seen these. So what is this, a gray, gray tree frog? Toad? Uh, I think this is common, common gray. They're the ones that like hang out on bark, right? Yeah. There's a car coming. I'm gonna move it. You good? Yep. So if you touch a gray tree frog and then touch your eyes, they will burn for like an hour. So uh -oh. help me remember not to touch my eyes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what if you like uh, lick it? I don't know. I'm gonna try that. <laughs> okay. Oh, did you just learn this through experience? Yes. <laughs> Well, no, I'm big road trips, you know what I do? Um, <laughs> when you have a day that's over 15 hours, you stop one time for food and you get three meals. And the you two, buy three meals at once? Yeah, and the three that you don't eat, or the two that you don't eat, you just put on the dashboard in the sun and they stay warm all day. I'm really surprised that we haven't seen any snakes since the rat snake. Very odd. Yeah, that's a rainin'. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> he just turned around. No, okay. <laughs> it. Yeah, you gotta turn the strobe light on for him so they. I didn't mean to. <laughs> well, you know, that actually is a great way to get a frog, like just strobing the crap out of them and then, like, <laughs> walking up to them and grabbing them. Just pepper spray. <laughs> Shoot them with a luck. I think that counts towards the light bulb. I made, I made the choice to run it over, so, so it counts. Oh yeah, you just ate that taco after handling the gray tree frog, oh, right? I don't care. It's a little gonna get in my eyes. <laughs> There's no way it only affects your eyes and not your well, I don't, entire inside. I don't have sensation like sensors in my stomach, so. <laughs> you just care about how it feels, not what it's doing. Yeah. I don't want my eyes to burn all night, that sucks. <laughs> ah, I was hoping it was a mud snake, just a water snake. It's a nice banded though. Look at the orange on his cheeks. Gosh, that's all the bands. I was really hoping it might be a mud. Oh man. You've got some nasty musty. Look at the belly on that guy. 
The bandies are real nice bellies. Oh, yeah, that's a nice color. This is probably a quote-unquote lifer for you. We don't have these in the triangle. Uh, yeah, I guess so. <laughs> to your life list that you care so much about. <laughs> yeah. Very up-to-date, well-documented. Ooh, that, I think that already a must be too. <laughs> this smells even more musky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I smell it. I've been watching a lot of um, like police interrogations and missing persons <laughs> cases. This is definitely the scene, or at least one of them. Yeah, so when I like set up tin like in my old neighborhood, was I just like, because I would flip it like midday to afternoon. <laughs> so maybe that was part of the problem. Yeah. That's a big rough green. So vibrant. Oh man. I haven't seen one of these in so long. That's huge. Look how long that is. Yeah, I've never seen one this big. He must have moved before the storm or something. He wasn't here when we came by the first time. You said a snake? Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. Sorry, cars. I need to see the snake. Was it this far down? Uh, you'd be surprised how far you go when you're going fast. Yeah. Maybe it got off. Maybe it was good. Because it was definitely a thing. Maybe if it wasn't a snake, it was a shape. Oh, it's another rat snake. It's got a meal in it. Oh, it ate? Yeah. I just didn't want to pull too far off the road before I stopped. Much nicer, what does that mean? Just nicer colors. I don't want to handle him because he's probably going to regurge that meal. <laughs> I wonder what he ate. I would assume a frog, I don't know. Yeah, probably. Oh. <laughs> I just slipped. This is front wheel drive? What is yeah. That? In Florida, my first Florida trip, I backed into a canal. <laughs> <laughs> On purpose? No. That looked like it could have been corn snake. Don't hit it. Don't you dare hit it. Snake. We just got a corn. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> These are rare. This is target species for sure. Why are we not driving? There we go. <laughs> That's a corn snake, baby. <laughs> that is a corn. Hell snake. yeah, North Carolina corn snake. I've only ever seen two of these before. Really? That's freaking awesome. Huh. Yeah, they're not super easy to find in North Carolina. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I get a milkshake at cookout. <laughs> milkshake at cookout. Oh, milk <laughs> milkshake. That's a nice one too for North Carolina. Jeez. What does that mean? What do you mean for North Carolina? Like they're just not as pretty in North Carolina as they are oh. in Florida. <laughs> Might have a pantheropus. Oh, he he ate tonight. Look at that. He's fat. He's upside down a lot. I don't know if that means anything. Like his head. If you're down for it, another herping tradition is uh, whenever you get the target, you get a selfie with everyone who's there. Oh, sure. I think eyes are open. <laughs> That's a terrible <laughs> selfie. Hell yeah, we got a corn snake. That is awesome. You're not wrong about that. Hey, at least the one skull I have is a weird acting reptile. He's probably got a few more days of life in him. Cool, you good? Yep. I don't know, I'm kind of a fan of the lazy herping. Yeah, it's fun, man. Cruising is my favorite. Much more stamina. Can go longer. Just be glad I didn't take you to the sand hills. The, there's like no common species there basically. There's only just really hard to find targets. Yeah. So, I'm in the right. Is that car going the wrong way? Yeah, so there's just, there's like lots of really cool target species there. Like just basically coach whips and hog noses and pine snakes. And that's all you're gonna get there. <laughs> and scarlet kings. Yeah, when you said the name coach whip, I remember as a, like a little herper, that was my, my dream snake to find was a coach whip for some reason. I didn't get my first Eastern coach until this year. I finally got it. Are they even in the triangle area? No, the triangle. In the sand hill stuff. Oh, I was looking for it in the triangle. <laughs> what a big rabbit? No. Is that a dog? <laughs> it just looked like a regular dog. <laughs> Why is there a dog? Like, <laughs> I can't think of what else would have like a short tail like that. Yeah, and it's ear, it, was, it had like dog ears. <laughs> but it was running like a rabbit. Yeah. Dude, I've cruised some creepy dogs in the mountains, like cruising, night cruising in the mountains. You like, cruised creepy dogs, like <laughs> creepy domestic dogs? Yeah, like I rounded the corner, and there's this like big like white dog just standing in the middle of the road, didn't run or flinch, just stared at me. Oh. And it was like so creepy, I just like slowly like drove around it, and it never moved. <laughs> okay. It was so scary. And uh, for the two sides, I'll take two beef quesadillas. Oh, you wanted that as a tray? Yes, please. And then she said 
No, uh, two, uh, two beef quesadillas, actually. Chicken quesadillas? <laughs> beef quesadillas. Beef quesadillas? <laughs> beef, please.